Hello once again dudes, my name is Emil and I bombed another JavaScript tutorial. In this tutorial I'm gonna be showing you how to make a simple function that basically says like Alright, um we're telling when this document was last modified. So in your body go ahead and type in like uh, bay for bold this document was last modified on. And you might be seeing a lot of uh, websites uh, have like where it's saying when it was last modified. Um, it might when you see this, you might be thinking that it was more easy than it would have been expected. There's two ways of doing it. Um, first, you can build a function with it. I'm gonna call this uh, last modified. All right, and uh, inside here, go ahead and type in something simple like document. Right, all right, and parentheses, and then now what in here? Am I thinking we're going to type in quotation mark action manually? Go ahead and type what date is and stuff like that. Well, nope, because that's not how you're doing programming, dude. Um, we have functions to do that. Uh, so what you need to do is you need to type in inside here without even adding quotation marks, because that that's simply not necessary. That's the beauty of uh, programming, basically. If you have programming, that's not that's well that might be necessary sometimes, but well that's not the case right here in JavaScript. We can do something simple like we can actually go ahead and type in a function in here that gets all this information for us. We don't need to go ahead and get advanced. We don't even need to be thinking much. We just need to type in here. So inside here, type in document last. Modified. And remember, it's important that the uh, I'm back. So what this is saying, all right? We're taking this document and we're printing out when did did we last save this or edit that. So right now, when we uh, save and run it, we won't be getting anything because we haven't called the function yet, of course. So what we'd like to do in here, I'm gonna we need to type in last right, modified. All right. So if we save this now. It will get awesome. I ready? Got um, and this is when the document was last modified. Um, and of course, if you wish, you can go. Uh, no, that's not for this tutorial. Actually, that's for the next one. So uh, basically, now I've learned how to tell your browser when the document was last modified. So basically, that's it for this tutorial, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you learned something. And I'll see you in the next tutorial.